cut a clip, you're going to hit S. Just going to cut that clip. So then with that clip, we're going to hit delete on the keyboard. So we'll delete it from there and we'll have kind of a fade in. So this is where the fading comes in. Hey guys, what is up? My name is Trevin Rudy, and today we're gonna go into the intro of Sony Vegas 14. Let's do it, boys. Okay, so first off in this video, I'm gonna show you how to fade footage, how to cut footage, and then how to adjust the volume on your video. So those are the three things we're gonna focus on. So first off, once you open Sony Vegas 14, you're kinda not sure where to go from, so it's actually pretty easy. So you have your box over here, which will give you the live preview of your footage. Then you have your timeline so you know exactly where your footage is and you can import your footage. So if you hit file, open, then from here I, I have a bunch of um, League of Legends footage since I'm big into League of Legends and that's going to be the main gameplay that I'm going to show you guys. Um, so then you can basically click on your footage that you want and then hit open. Hit open and so this is going to come up. Do you want to set your project video settings to match the media? You can either hit yes or no. So this is going to basically say with the video footage that you recorded, it's going to go off of that. So for example, if it's 1920 by 1080, then it should be that. I'm going to hit no, so I know that I'm going to get the best footage. So actually right here it says project 1920 by 1080. From there it'll show you exactly what you're already going at. So if you want to, what you can, you hit file, properties, and your project property is going to come up. This is going to be what your video is going to be based at. I mean, 1920 by 1080 is going to be shooting at 1080 HD, so it's not 720, so it's really bad frames. Also, it is shooting at about 30 frames per second. So then, if that's not highlighted, you can find in here, there's a bunch of different options. I just like to go with the standard HD 1080 by 60i, so it gives you the best quality. Then you're going to hit apply, then OK. So first, we'll take this footage, and we'll take this footage. So let's say if I'm on this, we can actually zoom in a little bit so you can see a little bit easier. Okay, we'll say that we want, okay, we're going about that. Okay, so then what we want to do is we want to cut once I start going in. So play, then hit that. And then to cut a clip, you're going to hit S. Just going to cut that clip so then with that clip we're going to hit delete on the keyboard so we'll delete it from there and we'll have kind of a fade in so this is where the fading comes in so i like to go a little closer so i can see exactly how much i want to fade so if you go to the very top we'll say fade in offset so then i like to fade in just a little bit so it's not too crazy so like half a second usually so then we're going to go from there i'm going to play the clip so have a nice little fade in basically and we'll say let's cut it about there. So then we're gonna hit S again. And we're gonna get rid of this footage right here. So hit the delete key again. And then I'll say I'll just fade it out. So we'll fade that guy out a little bit. Just basically about half a second. And we'll say that with this I kind of want to adjust the audio. So then we'll say that we'll cut right there, and this bar will come up. So from here you're gonna click on this. Because first off, it will come up with those two. So you're going to click on the audio, which is going to be your red bar. And you're see the gains. You're going to slowly move down that to mute, basically. And then, once it goes to the second clip, no audio. And I'll move this guy over. So we'll zoom out again. Move this over. Have this guy there. And then we'll hit play. And there you go. It's not that hard. Honestly, it just takes time and watching a bunch of YouTube videos. That's how I learned Sony Vegas so good. So hopefully this tutorial was very useful for you guys. If you did like it, thumbs up. If you have different like recommendations that you want me to show you guys in Sony Vegas, Adobe Premiere, and then hopefully Final Cut later if I can, comment below and I'll be happy to respond to you guys. Hopefully going to try and do one or two videos per week. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys next week. Have a good one, you guys.